$1,300 in candles say what? Okay, so I'm literally going to show you all of the candles that I got. Look, I have one, two, three. I don't even know. I can't even count. Yeah. That's how many candles I have. Crazy. Crazy. So crazy. Hola, bienvenidos a mi canal. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you don't know who I am, my name is Calissa. Sorry I'm out of breath, but I literally have all these candles that I bought, like stacked. Ten. I have ten that pile up and each rack holds six. Look, look. Like six for someone normal is enough, but not for me. So in this video, I'm just going to show you every single candle that I got in the candle sale and um, just an extra thing that I got also in Bath & Body Works that I've been loving. So if you guys want to see what I got at Bath & Body Works this November 2018 for the candle sale, just keep watching. So sorry about the fan. I had to turn it on because it started to get a little hot up in here. It started to get a little hot. So if you hear the fan or a noise that you hear, that's what it is. There's this scent at Bath & Body Works. And I heard about it first through Nicole Guerrero because obviously that's like my best friend. She just doesn't know yet. So she was the one that recommended it to me first. Obviously I had heard about it, but I never really was like intrigued to get it. And then she's like, oh my God, it's amazing. I was like, oh, okay, she likes that scent. Cool. So I go to the candle sale, right? And I ended up picking out a candle, which is scented winter candy apple. And I smell it and it's like probably the best thing I've ever smelled in like my entire life. And so the next day I went to Bath & Body Works and I got basically everything that they sell in Winter Candy Apple that I can get my hands on. So the first two things that I have is the Winter Candy Apple um, Fine Fragrance Mist. And this is our little right here. And it just honestly smells like a Winter Candy Apple. Um, damn! I always have a mist and a cream. I have like a, actually a couple of them like underneath my bathroom, but I like... I don't like using like the same thing and then I have the cream now they have the cream this is the body cream um, it's 24 hours and it's ultra moisturizing and it's ultra shea so the difference between this one and the one that comes in the bottle this one is thicker so if you look at thicker moisturizer this one's your best bet if you're super 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 dry and you really need to like lather that moisturizer on and it needs to be a little thicker um, that's what's good about this one but they're both 24 hour wear That's the difference, so I decided to get the Winter Candy Apple, the Ultra Shade, just because I honestly like how this looks better, and this was the last one, and it's just like all red and festive and cute, and so I was like, I don't really care if it's thicker or thinner, like, I don't really mind, so I ended up getting this one basically based on how pretty it looks and the fact that it's all red, and I like that, so, um, that's why I got that, <laughs> but obviously I cannot mix match, I can't just get spray and, like, not have the cream, like, that doesn't make any sense to me, like, and then I got these two things because I had like a lot of cute different coupons so I was excited about that. So I got the Winter Candy Apple Diamond Shimmer Mist because this one <laughs> is so glittery and I was like what? Like hello glitter equals Christmas equals holiday equals happiness like it smells just like just like the scent just with glitter like oh my god really cool like if you have something that you're like showing your chest you could just spray it and you look all festive and glittery and you'll smell really good so I decided to get that and also like the liquid is pink like I couldn't pass up on it. Um, Shimmer Fizz Body Lotion so this is also a glittery diamondy type of thing and it's a foam but it's a lotion so I never had anything like this before this was actually pretty expensive this was $16.50 but I had a little coupon that said any products winter candy apple $16.50 or under you can get for $8 and I was like cha -ching, cha -ching. Oh my God. this freaking lip gloss it tastes so amazing that I'm just like like what is the sorcery if you get anything from here I definitely recommend getting this and this is pretty cheap it's like $5.50 it's amazing it's called liplicious lip gloss <laughs> I used to have Bath & Body Works like lip glosses before but like 
and I like this like where has this been on my life and then on top of it oh my god when you take it out it's glitter like oh my gosh amazing and just the, the taste and the smell is just so luscious and I love it beat of the video which is all the candles that I got at the candle sale somewhere else I spent like $448 in total um, with the candles with like my 20% off that I had um, and then the candles being $8.75 which is so awesome but technically these are worth $1,300 so <laughs> stop talking and I'm just gonna show you which candles I got why I got them and if I recommend them to you so the first um, 12 that I have on my desk, I have six of these in one parcel. This one is the Marshmallow Fireside Candle. Yep. This is the Marshmallow Fireside Candle. And this literally just smells like you're sitting down in your cabin and you light up the fireplace and you have some scented vanilla wood. And you got a piece of marshmallow hooked on a piece of vanilla scented wood and you just heating up the marshmallow and you're loving life and you have no cares in the world and you're a millionaire and th this is what this smells like. This is my favorite scent to put during the holidays because it just reminds me of like Christmas and feeling rich but like on the inside you know because <laughs> the way my baby cat is it up right now. <laughs> but I feel rich on the inside though. You know like you're like a woodsman and he's like chopping down that tree and he real cute like really be weird and looking all fine and you're just eating your marshmallows and it gets stuck in your teeth that's kind of like what the fireside marshmallow smells like I have six of those and I have them in like two different styles I have it in this cute little marshmallow with the snowflakes and the little marshmallows and a little ASMR for you and I'm gonna give you top five scents that is definitely my top five so I have four more okay so next this one my dad picked out he loves candles too oh my god he's like a die hard for candles and this one is called um, cherry frost never heard of it before super beautiful I love the purple and it smells really good it literally smells like a cherry Love it, it smells really good um, and then I have um, blueberry sugar. Blueberry sugar. This one is blue on the inside. And it definitely smells like really strong blueberries, but with like like candy or something in it. Yeah, it says sweet blueberries, brown sugar, and graham ham cracker crust. Yeah, it smells like it smells like blueberries with a lot of sugar on it. And this one, oh my gosh, I think Amanda Ensing recommended it to me. I only got one because I don't want my freaking, oof, that shit is strong. Uh, this one is the Campsite Coffee. And this literally smells like you're in Starbucks. Like, <laughs> wow. It's like, seriously, like you're smelling like a whole bag of like coffee. It's crazy. So I'm excited to try that and see. My dad smells like, he's like, whoa, that smells crazy. And I'm like, yeah, let's get it. He's like, okay. So the next one that I got is Frosted Cranberry. How beautiful are like, just the presentation of it. Like when I finish the candle, I'm like, oh, I don't want to throw it away. And this one smells really good. It smells like fruity. And I tried to get it at like half of the scents that I like, which I like more like perfumey scents just like in my rooms and stuff like certain scents that smell like really sexy but my parents really love like fruit scented things so I tried to get like a compilation of both you know and thank god that my mom and dad like love candles because I'm so blessed like that they love candles because I love candles too so it's just a nice little like when someone coming over and like you have the candle lit up it just makes everything like more homey you know what I mean and just the smell is amazing especially when you have a strong scented candle like if you go like that and you have to really dig in you know that the candle is going to be a little bit more softer but when you smell when you could smell it like all the way from out here that shit is strong and this shit is strong this is real good this is the frosted cranberry one and it just smells like cranberries with like some sugar but with like another fruit in it red apple and it has another fruit in it you see i was right and this you know the sale is only once a year and it's always in november i would always look out um november 1st like 
I mean, I would follow them the whole year round because they're always coming out with really cool scents. But I would follow them. And maybe if you couldn't make the candle sale this year, this could be like helpful for you to like know which ones to like look and like which ones I recommend for you to like pick out and smell and stuff for next year because they have I think something crazy like 140 or 120 different scents it's something wild like that and who the hell's gonna go through 120 different candles like no I mean I would but a lot of people will not the next one that I got is hot cocoa and cream this one is made with essential oils and the last one that I, the coffee one that I showed you is also made with essential oils I don't know what that means like if that means like that the oils are gonna come out and then magically go into my body and just like moisturize me like I'm kind of confused about that so I don't gotta put moisturize on so why did I get this like this one is called hot cocoa and cream I'm so crazy oh and this one literally smells like hot cocoa mm, in like a really beautiful mug and you're just sitting down like all cozy with like a fuzzy blanket and you dipped like some marshmallows in the hot cocoa and you just doop, put on Netflix and you watch how the Grinch stole Christmas. Hot mag, sandalwood, essential oil, steamed milk. Milk, that's exactly, milk, chocolate and milk. That's that's what it smells like. It literally smells like you put like milk on your chocolate. But I almost missed your call. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. How you doing? You look pretty. <gasps> Not as pretty as you. Shut up. So is that a good thing or a bad thing? Yeah, well, I don't know. We're going to have to see when I get my score back. Oh, my God. Mm. Oh, my God. Mm. I can't wait to freaking light this one up. This one smells so amazing. I wish I got, like, five of them. A pistachio ice cream, a white barn. I love the ones that are, like, white barn. And how freaking beautiful is like just the present. This is called pistachio ice cream and literally smells like a pistachio ice cream with a dash of sexiness. It's amazing. I love it. It's roasted pistachio almond extract and vanilla extract. Vanilla, you see that sexy. And then for the other parcel that I have, I have six of the same ones. So obviously I'm not going to show you all six. But this is bergamot waters. This is one of my favorite scents. Eva. I remember I used to have a friend who used to light this with another candle um, that I was like obsessed with and it just smells so beautiful and like sexy and it kind of smells like manly but with like a twist of like femininity and it's like so pretty and she used to light this up both of them together and they smelled amazing I actually remember I <laughs> it's so funny she had this one lit and she had like took out the fire and so we had waited a little bit I don't know what we were doing but um, I ended up smelling it and then I, the whole thing poured and went all of the whole wax went all over my my shirt and everything it didn't burn me thank God but I was just like in shock you know and all we could do is help but laugh <sighs> good times and um, the, the notes are sparkling bergamot I love anything bergamot um, so I, this one's sparkling bergamot this is um, it has sugared citrus and creamy sandalwood so that's how you get like the muskiness from oh I just wanted to say bergamot waters that's like one of my top five just to let you guys know I really do have six of them look at they all look blue zombie I don't like oh my god so beautiful I have two of these this is the comfort cashmere blanket and this one is also made with essential oils because it's for like your air and stuff to purify no i'm just kidding i don't know but this one smells really good it's a fluffy cotton sheer musk and lavender essential so it has like that lavender base but it's like it, that's what it smells like it smells like a cloud like it's so weird how amazing they name these it's so beautiful i have this one this one's called mahogany teakwood mm, and this one's just like a man it just smells like a man you light this up you need a man also have the same one just in high intensity I remember I actually broke one of my candles I was taking it out um, of this and it like fell and this this shit this will cut like let me tell you so this one is cinnamon spiced vanilla and I love it it literally smells like vanilla like if you heat it up like milk and put vanilla and like some some cinnamon and spices in it, that's how it smells. 
Yep, vanilla bean. <laughs> Smells super good. And I actually like to put this one next to my room because my room is gray, so it like matches. And then I have this one here. This one, my mom loves it. This one's called Golden Peach Sparkle. And first of all, the packaging is so beautiful. It's so festive. It reminds me of like New Year's. And so this one smells like, ooh, it smells like peaches, but like a sexy peach. You know what I'm saying? And the notes are juicy peaches, sparkling bergamot. Bergamot, you see, with like sexiness. And so this one is called Tis the Season. I love this one. This one smells so good. It literally smells like just apples. Like you made like a fresh apple pie, but it like you decorated the top of it with like Christmas decorations. Like that's what it smells like to me. Oh, I love like... I love how that looks, a little Christmas tree with the gingerbread little house and look at the wrapping paper and the little scissors and the ribbon and like the window with the snow coming outside. I want to live there. Love that. I have two of those. But the other one, I got it like this. This one, I have two of these. This one's called Frozen Lake. This one's also made with essential oils because it's going to moisturize your skin, you know? Um, it smells super super cute it smells really like clean to me with like a fresh of like like imagine you're in a line you're gonna go skiing okay the wind is blowing and it's snowing a little bit the guy in front of you just took a shower and he washed his clothes and it smells like a little bit of his perfume his body odor and um like detergent like he just washed it and that smell that just comes and poof, smacks you in the face smells so good. That's what this is. So if you want to go skiing but you're scared like I am, get this candle because that's what it's going to be. Jun Juniper berry, eucalyptus, and lavender essential oils. What the hell is juniper berry? Like, I don't know. How pretty. It's so cute. And this one actually smells exactly like bergamot waters. And it is called pineapple mango and I knew that my mom would love it and I wish I would have gotten her like three more um she absolutely loved this one it literally smells like pineapple mango like a pina colada but with a lot of pineapple and mango that's what it smells like with like a little bit of like cream in it yeah fresh fresh pineapple juice mango and vine riped raspberry mm. three bergamot waters in the next parcel so I'm not gonna you know take it out again because I already showed you that but this one, Cactus Blossom, is my number one favorite. Oh my goodness. This is the one that, you know, the friend that I had, she used to put this one on with the bergamot waters, and oh my gosh. But, like, I had to pick one. This one just smells so amazing. And then they put it pink. Like, was, were you made for me? Like, oh, look, I'm used it. Mm. So amazing. So the notes on this are... Cactus flower petals, sunkissed coconut. That's why I love it because I love coconut. Vanilla and fresh sparkling lemon. Oh, like, it's amazing. It has the coconut with the lemon that gives it like that fresh scent, but then it has like the vanilla that makes it grounded and make it like sexy, you know? Mm. I have another marshmallow forest fireside because I was obsessed with that before I found out that I was obsessed with cactus blossom. And then I have this one, which I never like because I don't really like the smell, but I'll have it because it was it's Halloween edition. So I always put this like on display during Halloween. But oof, I don't like it like at all. Yeah, I don't like it at all. This one has perfect pump pumpkin, black cat's clove, ghostly vanilla, and batty brown sugar. Like I got it just because of how it looked. Like, hello, it's so freaking cute. And then the top is all black and glittery like my soul. It kind of smells like you baked cookies that are like pumpkin, pumpkin themed. But you kind of let them burn a little bit. And you're waiting like a whole month to eat them. That's how it smells. It looks like I have a lot of different ones, but in reality, I probably have half of like the same ones. This blossom. See the pink? You guys see the pink? No? This one has all of my favorite, my number one favorite. So I have quite a bit of those. Parcel, I have this one. This one's called Endless Summer. This one smells so good. I've never smelled this shade before. Oh my god. 
and I got two of these. This one kind of smells like bergamot water, it's just like lighter and less strong, but still strong in its own way, but not, you know what I mean? Like, it's fresh is what it is. It's like a sexy fresh. It's like summer fresh. I love it. This one, oh my gosh, this one smells so amazing. We, have, we got two of these as well. This one's called Copper Coconut. This one was the first one that I smelt when I went into the, the store. And it's so pretty and orange. And it's going to look so nice. Oh my god. It smells like coconut, right? Like you, this literally smells like you're in like the side of the beach in like a cabana. And the cabana boy is like bringing you a whole coconut. And it's cold. And you know, you just have a cute little straw and an umbrella next to it inside the coconut because he cut a hole in it. And you're just sipping the, the coconut water and just loving your life. And you see right in front of you like palm trees and clear blue skies and clear water. And you see all the little cute fish and you see a dolphin and he's waving at you. So you waving back and you see, you know, Ursula and you're telling her to go away because she doesn't match with the sea. And you see the little mermaid and Eric, like they're like on their really pretty yacht, you know. And it's cute. Soft ambers and sea salted shells. Exactly. That's exactly what I was thinking. Like, it's a coconut but with salt on it. It smells so good. And then I have two of these because why the hell not? This one's called Japanese Cherry Blossom. And I got this for my mama. Because I know that she loves this scent. So I got her two of them. I usually don't like florally scents. But I can get really jiggy with this one. And so I got two of these. This one is, I love like the ones that are in like a solid color too because it just gives like, it, it's going to give the room like life, you know what I mean? So this one's called Island Margarita and when I saw it I was like, yes, this has to smell tropical, right? This literally smells like as if you're at SeaWorld and you brought a container, like a water bottle filled with like papaya juice and mixed with coconut and orange and you're just drinking it and you're at SeaWorld and you're watching Shamu and you brought it because you can't really afford to like because you paid so much for the ticket that you can't afford to get like the soda there because it's expensive so you brought it from the house that's what this smells like sweet mandarin island mango and sea salt you see mango off oh this one's called cactus blossom I just, I, I've only smelled it once that day, but I know it smells good. Oh. It really smells like the cactus blossom, kind of, but just a little different. So I know it has coconut in it. Yep. Sunkissed coconut. I love it. No. No, this one's cactus blossom. I'm so shooketh right now. This is cactus blossom. This is the pink one. This is just, it looks different. Mm. So I have I got two of those white peach oh moz gods I love anything peach I've been like so obsessed with peach this past year like it's insane so when I saw this I was like I'm getting it I don't even care if it smells good or bad I'm getting it because I like peaches but it smells so good it smells real good this one has juicy peaches dew covered leaves and a hint of vanilla dew covered leaves how does one acquire that fragrance? It smells amazing. It smells like peaches and it smells like dew covered leaves and it smells like a hint of vanilla. I have two of those. I love it. And then I have four more to show you. The one that I have to show you is this one, Winter Candy Apple. Hello. How freaking beautiful. I have two of these, one in front of me and one um, in my bathroom. And then I have this one. I should have gotten two of them. I should have, but I didn't. This one's Watermelon Lemonade. I love the watermelon lemonade um, wallflowers. It comes in seasons and it's amazing. I don't know why I didn't get to them. I'm such an idiot. It smells so beautiful. It literally smells like watermelon. And I feel like watermelon is just like water. So it's like, how can it have a specific smell? But yo, you smell this and it smells like watermelon. It's just amazing. Watermelon ice, sparkling water. Sparkling water. Because sparkling water has a scent. Okay. Second to last one, I know we're almost finished, we're almost finished. This one's called Sparkling Icicles. I thought I had a Sparkling Icicles, but maybe it was the one that I got last year that I used up. And it smells real good. Oof, it smells just fresh. 
It smells like you just cleaned like your whole house and you just washed your clothes and then you took a shower and you like really scrubbed, you know what I'm saying? And you do a little, little ear scrub, put on a fresh like pair of like clothes that you just washed and you just smell it all fresh and clean and you put some deodorant on, that's what this smells like. Sparkling ice, holiday greenery, and fresh bergamot. How does one acquire holiday greenery in a jar? I feel like holiday greenery, it does smell like a greenery, this. But it smells like green, but it smells like fresh, like clean. Like if you're outside and you just like mowed the lawn, that's also what this smells like. And then the last one, oh my goodness, this one probably is like my second to least favorite because that Halloween one, that one doesn't smell good. But I still really like it, but it's like my, like out of all of them, this was really pushed like to the bottom. The only reason why I got this one was because I saw a picture of it on Bath and Body Works the night before I knew the sale was and that one just kind of like caught my eye. And I said to myself, if you don't get that one, you really didn't participate in the candle sale. So you have to get it, whether it smells good or not. It's called gooey marshmallow. <laughs> It smells good. It smells like vanilla-y, really marshmallow-y. It smells good and I like marshmallows. Anything that has marshmallow I usually really love but I guess I love the marshmallow fireside because it has that hint of like wooden-esque to it. It's kind of like you're looking at Chuck E. Cheese and all the kids love marshmallows so you bought them a whole bunch because you know it's a big pack. You get a big pack and it's cheap. You have to send goodie bags so you got the dollar goodie bags and you just stuff marshmallows in it. That's like what this scent kind of gives me. Alright guys, so that is it. That is all I got at Bath & Body Works. That's all I got. I know I just only I only spent $450 in candles. No big deal. If you guys got anything in the candle sale, please let us just know. I would love to know what are your favorite scents. I'm going to leave my top favorite five scents down below. Um, if I can't think of five, then I'll think of three. I know f one of them for sure is the Cactus Blossom. That's number one. Number two, Marshmallow Fireside. Number three, Bergamot Waters. I'll, 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 I'll think of something. <laughs> but um, that is all I have for you guys today. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please make sure to subscribe and to hit the notification bell in order to be notified when I post new videos because, I'll, because I'm going to be posting a lot in December. Like, I love you guys. Thank you so much for checking out this video. And remember to share this video with everybody that you know so that they know how crazy I am for buying all these freaking candles. Like, who does that? I don't know, but apparently I do. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you guys want to see how to get this look, then check out the video um, that has this kind of picture in it so that you guys can recreate it if you like it. And thank you guys so much for watching. I hope my little bimbas have a blessed day.